hello guys you are welcome back to prospect channel tv thank you very much for stopping by please do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you have not thank you very much once again may god bless you all the trial of nandekanu the leader of the indigenous people of biafra ipop on wednesday resumed at the federal high court in abuja however unlike previous trials Daily Post reports that the court authorities dismissed some of the stringent conditions surrounding Kano's trial. Also, journalists and other media practitioners were granted access to the courtroom after proper identification. Also, lawyers and litigants are allowed to witness the terrorism felony charges brought against the Biafra Nation agitator by the federal government. Regardless of this, there is a heavy security presence at the court as operatives of the Department of State Services, DSS, have taken perfect control of the security situations within and outside the court premises. The court had last month issued a practice direction which moved that, which moved the trial to 6CT believed to be large and special enough to accommodate the crowd that usually switch to witness the trial. The practice direction endorsed by the chief judge of the court justice, Justice John, had also prohibited media coverage except were expressly permitted. However, the court has chosen the stringent conditions attached to the trial, although reasons for, for diverting from the practice direction have not been made known, it was gathered that Jabi Code of Conduct Tribunal was considered too porous for such a sensitive trial, especially from the security point. Apart from unhindered assets being granted to lawyers and media practitioners, Roads leading to the courts are not blocked. Why food vendors are also having their businesses done without molestation? <laughs> How can Nigerian government things that you know they are beginning to understand the language which said release Mazin Namdekano? I love what is going on now. They are no longer stiff. <laughs> to their former directions and all that. So they are not allowing people to come in. See, the federal government have no case against the IPOB leader. And they know. They know all this. And that is the reason why uh, they are beginning to understand, you know, the language. Also remember, uh, record that the American uh, lawyer, Mazin Nandikano's, American lawyer Bruce Fem has petitioned Nigerian government, you know, to ICC. Who knows whether or not all those things come, they make them, they try to shake body. Hmm. Okay, someone said here, yeah, Mazin Nandikanu is a prophet. Any result against our, any insult, I beg your pardon, against our noble prophet will be considered blasphemy. We should be mindful of our tongue and accord our prophet the full respect because he's greater than all politicians in the country combined. Someone just dropped that. This British company must collapse. Someday and everybody will be free. Mazin Namdikano is blessed. He is a, he's my prophet. He loves his people in and out. May Elohim dedicate him, he say. Who told IPOB that the Fendi wearing dude in DSS custody is Nandekano? The guy being pandered, pandered, paraded in court by DSS and the zone security is Friday Wante from Ebony State. Mazen Nandekano is in Russia discussing with. Joe Biden on how to make Biafra a net, net, NATO member state. Okay, someone just dropped that. That is funny anyway. According to a pure and credible source, the trial is hereby hmm, adjourned. Further notice, maybe next year. Someone just dropped that. Okay, these are reactions, you know, by Nigerians. Hope to see 
Shawari there and his usual talks that we arrange to attack him, he gets news headlines. At the end, victory will be our names. We are going home. My Lord and my personal savior, Mazen Namikano, a significant difference between terror terrorism and treasonable felonies is the punishment attached by the code. Why treason is punishable by death? Treasonable felonies are punishable by imprisonment for life. Okay, someone just dropped that. At the end, victory will be yours. Nigeria is defeated. Nandikano is bigger than Nigeria. The strongest Igbo man alive. Love you for who you are. Onyendo. Okay, God bless you. Someone just said that. Prophet Mazin Nandikano, may God grant you all your heart desires. Let the court free Mazin Namdekano for his innocence of this whatever they have levied against him. Okay, guys, these are some reactions by Nigerians. The trial of Namdekano, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, on Wednesday resumed at the Federal High Court in Abuja. However, unlike previous trials, Daily Post reports that the court authorities dismissed some of the stringent conditions surrounding Kano's trial. Also, journalists and other media practitioners were granted access to the courtroom after proper identification. Lawyers and litigants are allowed to witness the treasonable felony charges brought against the Biafra Nation agitator by the federal government. Regardless of this, there is a heavy security presence at the court as operatives of the Department of State Services DSS have taken perfect control of the security situations within and outside the court premises. So guys, I'm dropping it here. More details will come your way. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you very much for late stopping by. Bye for now.